I am right now at the best I've ever been. It's actually pretty impressive. I think in the back of my mind, me turning 36, and for an athlete, you start thinking that's old. And because I'm very sound with my nutrition, I'm very diligent with the doctors that I go see. My conditioning has changed to the point where, I mean, the aerobic aspect of it is very important, but we train a lot of uh, anaerobic. Basically, most of my training is to be very explosive and then try to recover in between that, because really that's what heavyweight fighting is. Watch my workouts, there's a lot of pull-ups and push-ups and a lot of bodyweight calisthenic stuff. So instead of me trying to squat 400 pounds for reps, now I'm just doing box jumps and single leg lifts and, and maneuvering in that sort. It's tried and true and it, it's things that work. This is the best camp I've ever had. I never had a camp that started off with a booklet. Everybody's goals were written out and everything was put down on paper and graphs. We broke down Todd's style. I have different game plans set up and that we've trained for and um, basically whatever he decides to do indicates what game plan I'm going with. Todd Duffy, really one of his biggest holes is just his head. I think mentally he fights, you know, he's very, uh, anxious in the locker room and he has a lot of uh, nervous energy and uh, he channels that in the fight and he fights with a lot of emotion. It's not just a fight itself, being the main event, the requirements upon you as far as the interviews and the attention and sitting in that locker room being the last guy called up, that's a lot of anxiety that uh, I've dealt with well over 20 times in the UFC. Once they finally ring the bell, he's gonna come out hard and explosive and he's gonna be looking to finish me. And when I meet him with that explosion and power and speed and he realizes that this isn't gonna be an easy night, I think that he's gonna look for the opportunity for me to have a submission so he can go home early. So as far as who's gonna be calm and whose heart rate's gonna be staying lower, it'll be me. He'll be over there panicking, he'll be there freaking. And he has every right to be because uh, he called this, he asked for it and I'm willing to go ahead and give him what he wished for. Well, it's exciting for the fans because I think, one, Todd has a really good build. So you're going to see a very muscular, good-looking guy getting thrashed. And I think most people enjoy that, and that's fun. <laughs> oh, I'm absolutely back. Anybody that wants to think otherwise, uh, I hope they sign up to fight me next. Uh, after I go ahead and go through Todd, I'm looking to fight somebody who's actually ranked and move up the ladder, so I will not be denied. I look like I'm, my back's against the wall. It looks like I have one foot out the door. I keep coming back for more, and I won't stop until I have that third title. Thank you.